Johnson's got it. He's got the goal. Third down and the, and uh, it's third down and eight from Longview's 28-yard line for Denton Geyer. Two wise near side, one to the far side of the field. Third down and eight, probably four down territory for Geyer. 21-7 Longview on third down and long. Under center is Walsh. Now here comes motion back to the near side. Walsh going to play action pass. Here comes Longview up the middle. They're going to chase him from the pocket. He's going to run to the near side of the field. Now throw across the field. It's incomplete. Ping Brooks had a shot at it at the 15-yard line, and it's going to bring up fourth down. Ah, uh, the Longview's fans are booing because it looked like there was a hole against uh, Chris Weaver. I thought there was one. No call is made. Walsh was forced out of the pocket. Brent, he made a mistake there as he went to his right and tried to throw back all the way across the field, and that actually uh, Ping Brooks had a bead on it, and the pass just really wasn't that well thrown had it been to the receiver I think Brooks had an interception I do too it's fourth and eight at the 28 yard line spread formation two wides far side and one near side here's Walsh to the near side of the field he looks up and fires and this one is is it caught yes it was at the 12 yard line yeah we wow that was a nice throw and a nice catch and held on to and it actually was thrown into coverage. Longview had good coverage, but Walsh just fired it in there and uh, Russell with the catch. At the Longview 12, first down and 10, 6.05 to go in the half, 21-7. Longview leads. Denton guard Longview's 12-yard line. Let's see if Longview can hold. At the fir it's a first down and 10 at Longview's 12. Spread formation. Tight end near side of the field. Long count. Walsh. They give it to Will High, who comes up the middle. He got it to about the eight or nine yard line. It got a couple of yards. It's going to be second down and eight. 5.33 to go before halftime. Longview 21. Denton Geyer 7. Geyer football at Longview's 9 on second down and 8. At the Longview 9 yard line. Wide receiver comes near side of the field. That is Russell. I think, Brent, that uh, that actually is a sophomore. Oh, yeah, that's it. And uh, that's Connor Crane, and he is their fastest player. So see if they don't try to get it to him. Second down and eight. Walsh looks to the end zone. Chased out of the pocket. Chased behind. Throws it incomplete. Nice play. Chris Weaver put the pressure on Walsh, and it's incomplete. Walsh pats him on the head. It was a good play by Weaver and an incomplete pass by Walsh. It's third down and eight. At the Longview 10. That's Chris Weaver's speed, Brent. Well, that was the, the what they were trying. They had the two outside guys running inside routes, and they had uh, a guy coming in behind them, and they were going to try to make the play to him. But Chris Weaver's put so much pressure on Walsh that he just couldn't get the pass off, or at least he couldn't get it off with the accuracy. And uh, that guy is, I'm telling you, he's as fast as most teams' backs. He sure is, John. He is a tremendous player, Chris Weaver we're talking about. Denton Geyer is going to have to take a timeout. We'll take it with him on 104.1 The Ranch and be back in one minute. And it is third down and eight for Geyer at the Longview nine-yard line. They've got a wide receiver to the far side of the field along with the tight end. They're unbalanced to the far side. Stacked receivers in the backfield. Third down and eight. Spread formation. Motion moves outside. Walsh is going to run the zone. Re or get, no, he gave it off on the give, and it's a touchdown. Well, that's a <laughs> that's what he's there for, to make the read and give it to the right person. I think everybody thought Walsh kept the ball as it was. He, he gives the ball off, and he, he gets it to Sebastian Williams, who is a sophomore running back. And I don't know. That's a surprise play that works. It sure did. It's a touchdown, and it's a 21-13 it's a game. Geyer converted on uh, at least two third down and longs. Here's the extra point try. It is up. It is good. It's 21 to 14. Longview, 450 to go in the half. Back on 104.1 The Ranch in one minute. Well, welcome back, John. 21-14. Now, that's vintage Denton Geyer that time. A 12-play 80-yard drive. They converted three third down plays. 
the score, a nine-yard run by Sebastian Williams, and it comes with uh, 450 to play. It's 21-14 Longview with uh, just under five minutes to go in the, in the half. Here comes the kick. This one's going to go to McGee. No, Javoris Poole. He's out to the 21-yard line. That's where he ran to the 21. The return men that time were McPool and Tomlinson. So Longview scrimmage from their 21, first and 10. 21-14, nice drive of guard to, to, uh, to get it to a one-score game. The amazing thing is on you know, the biggest play of the half, they give it to a sophomore running back, and uh, I think it fooled Longview a little bit. He was up, got his first carry of the game, and gets a touchdown. That's Sebastian Williams. Here comes Aaron Johnson in the game for Longview quarterback at the 21-yard line where they were scrimmaged with 4.43 to go in the half. Guy's got... Uh, one timeout left. Longview's got two. High formation for Longview. First down and 10 from the 21. There goes Hunt. Right side he goes. Knocked down. No gain. Second and 10. At the, it's going to be a second down and 10 play from the 21. 429 to go here before halftime. 21-14. Longview leads. P.D. Robertson back in the game along with Bashan McGee. Run with Elder at wide receiver. So it's second down and 10. Spread formation for Longview on second down and 10. McGee the quarterback. Two wides near side and one goes to the far side of the field. Here comes Fortson back in motion. Here's Johnson. They're going to run the inside shuttle pass. And it's not much to the 25. It's going to be third down, and Longview needs six at the 25-yard line. Now they ran the, the shuttle pass to Petey Robertson, and the play le actually looked pretty good as it started out, but uh, didn't guy not fool. And uh, I think the defensive end that uh, came down on the play and uh, uh, made it and looked like going to be a play and it turned out not to be one. That's third down and six for Longview at their own 25 yard line. 3.20 to go before halftime. 21-14. Longview leads. Double wise near side and one to the far side of the field. Johnson back to throw it. Got to run the quarterback draw. Up the field. He comes close to a first down. He didn't get it. At the 29. He's two yards short at the 29 yard line. And that's going to bring fourth and two. Fourth and two at the 29-yard line. 